Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. Let's make it a great night, folks. Love is unconditional. And love, there are no conditions. You love for no reason with no justification. You are free to be what you are, and you allow others to be what they are. Market wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials trading up 57, NASDAQ up 212, SP's up 34. Gold, gold contract trading up $3.10 at 19.64 an ounce. We got silver up 69 cents, $25 an ounce. Light sweet crude up $1.33, trading at $77.08 a barrel, notes and bonds. A 10 year note. Trading up 25 ticks, 113.02. The 30 up a full point, plus six ticks at 126.31. And King Dollar, this is something else, man. King Dollar down 748 ticks, trading 99.773. Euro 112, yen at 137. The British pounds at 131 to 1 US dollar. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Give us a call, folks. Want to know what's going on in your world? In the world of the S&Ps, let's take a look at them. Let's go into the futures first. You really had, you know, this market started out, flat market, nothing happening all day long, and then it just started crawling, man. And, <laughs> and the lower that dollar went, the higher the market went. That's, a, that's just a no-brainer, man. That's just how it works. So bottom line is that right at this particular point, we get the futures up 33. If we go to, over the SPY and we take a look at the SPY, SPY's running right now. We have, yeah, I mean, it's a, it's a one-way market. You're up uh, $3.30, you're trading at four forty-nine, And even when we look at the SPY, you know, bottom line is that you're breaking away from this whole area. And uh, 4.43.90, you know, that's six points. Now, you know, six points can be done in a day as you get a downdraft, but the bottom line is that not yet. NDX, that's leading it once again. Actually, let's go look at the NDX, okay? So inside the NDX, you get Pindolado up almost 8%. Zscale is up 5.5%. Google's up 4.5%. JD.com's up 4.5%. Taken away from it, Fastenal's off 3%. You got Walgreens boots down 1%. You can see those, those are big numbers, man. And if we go NQ, we take a look at the NQs, what you're going to see is that you're basically way over the highs. Yeah, I mean, look at this. That's a break. And when you take a look at this, what we did, we had only done, the, the NDX didn't even do a 0 0.382 retracement. It almost hit it, but didn't do it. So that's a strong market, man. That's, that's the bottom line. Yeah, and I know we've been going up straight for five months right now. I mean, the bottom line is right since March, it's been a straight line move up. But guess what? <laughs> When you take a look at this dollar, man, this is a clobbering, I mean, in a monster way. This is, you know, these bars normally come in threes. Well, we got, we're almost at five of them right now. And if you take a look at this, what you're going to see is that there's not much between, you broke the whole consolidation. And the next place where there's any support at all comes down to, you know, 96. And there's not much. You can see this. I had this on a weekly. So at 96, you get about four months. Not, yeah, about, four, no, actually only three months of support. Let me bring this back a little bit for, further. I'll put it on a 10-year monthly, actually. Oh, yeah. Now, uh, I see what's going on there. Holy cow. Yeah, we're going to the bottom, man. We're going to 89. Because now what's happened, we're just getting inside it. Look at this. Watch this. Where is my thing? Yeah, let's see. Yeah, this is, a, this is a big number, man. Okay, there's that. Take this. Put that in a monthly. And then why do you see this? Yeah, you're already into it, man. We're going down here. Because what you have is that we just broke everything. You're in the lower range now. As soon as we got inside 109.71, you're in the lower range. That's, that's going to put game 
going all the way back to uh, 90, 8990. And then let's, what, what is an ABC? Let's see, 114. Yeah, it's 14. And that's 92. Okay, so check this out. This is pretty cool. 90 is down here. If you do, what is this? This is crazy. You do the ABC down, you also get 90. So the probability is much higher that that's where you're going to go. And, you know, we go down there, you're going to have the broad market continue higher. You're going to have the gold and silver market explode. And commodities in general explode, you know, because what, it ha what has also happened here, if you take a look at the gold market, see the gold market itself, each and every time that, you know, it's, well, it's been going sideways for three years, right? GC1. That being said, though, you're going sideways at a much higher level than with Ben. We'll put this up. Watch this. You can see how this is set up. You get the top. You get the bottom of the consolidation. And this is where it comes down to the last two times it hasn't been able to do that ABC. So we'll see what happens this time. It's going to go, you know, we're right, we're right next to the highs this time. So we'll see how this baby shakes out. But this is a big number because you got 1161. Oh, yeah, it's a beauty. Um, you get 900, which gets you 2,500. That's, that's how this baby's set up, man. You break that, you get 2,500 gold. And I expect that's what you're going to get because if the doll is going to 89, it's like, you know. Yet, yet, and this is where, you know, you do get higher numbers. Um, and but yeah, if you do the math behind you, I really can't buy more because our dollars are going down so dramatically. Now I go over to the euro. Now watch this. This is where this gets wild. This is where you can get your head wrapped around. Look at this. Look at this. The euro three months ago was only at a dollar six. Now you're a dollar twelve. Four months ago, the euro was a dollar five. Yeah. So stay right there, folks. Come back with our man, Mr. Tim Ward. We're going to be going through that uh, uh, gold market. We're going to be going through the S&Ps. And the bottom line, if you did go to that workshop, you know that he hit this uh, ball right out of the ballpark in a monster way. Dow. Dow Industrials right now up 76. NASDAQ's up 225. S&Ps up 37. We'll come right back, folks. <laughs>